Well, hey there, Bachelor Nation. It's Take 10 with Shane and Michelle. Back again, Shane. Bachelorette time, episode Oh my, two. hey, don't forget, subscribe, like, you know, make sure you stay tuned each week. We're, we're coming to you live, fast and furious here. But Jen is, you know what? I, I kind of like her as a bachelorette. She's doing pretty good. Yeah, she's been, you know, she's been interesting so far. I think time will tell as the as the drama heats up and it didn't take long for there to be drama. No. And remember what I said is the newbie I am? I thought, well, certainly the guys aren't going to be as dramatic as the girls. Well, I stand corrected in that. Shane, <clears throat> let's Isn't that crazy? talk about it. Isn't that crazy, though, that you wouldn't oh, think you? I mean, seriously, I'm just like, I was in total disbelief. I think one of the, one of the main things, well, let, let's, let's take a step back. Yeah. They're in the land down under. Oh, there. Yes. That was a great opening. Yes. Oh, they're my in gosh. Melbourne. They're so gorgeous, right? Gorgeous part of yeah. the world. Um, super pretty. Yeah. So we have our, 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 our feuds have started, but the feuds you know, have started. They, they have the first, the first big date. Yeah. Two feuds. Uh, but yeah, let's talk about that. They did a group date, right? So all the guys, they did the uh, Queen Victoria market. Ooh, that was interesting. Some interesting food. Oh yeah. Oh, I, uh, yeah. Uh, the Vegemite, which is, um, definitely the food of Australia that everybody talks about. Kangaroo I don't think kangaroo testicle. Yeah. What? Kangaroo testicles. Mm. Yeah. That's when they said kangaroo balls, I think they thought they meant they were meatballs, but uh, no, <laughs> ma'am, they were not. They were um, not. Yeah. And poor little Sam, Sam N. And I don't know if it was religious or cultural or what, but he couldn't eat anything. Yeah. You know, he was, like, I can't eat that. I can't eat that. So yeah, was, I don't know. I kind of would. I, I don't know. I, I, I know we might be uh, heading somewhere soon, but I might be pulling the uh, pescatarian card. Oh, on that you one. think? You think I already can see this happening, how it's going to play out. Um, but you, um, yeah, but she, uh, yeah, they're, they're two boys having a little feud. Uh, but, uh, you know, we did have a kissy kissy to, I mean, she's kissy kissy and all over the place too. Oh, she is. She is. I mean, so I thought it was interesting. Devin, as we all know, is the one who is just like, I'm just going to make sure that she knows and everybody else knows that I'm in it to win it. And I don't care who's, you know, what I'm one. <laughs> yeah. I'm just going to get in there. I, we, you know, we talked about Aaron and their tip and him saying, t telling Devin, he's making an ass of himself. Well, um, you know, I hate to say it. He did pull the, I mean, um, pulled the ice cream card. Devin pulled the ice cream card and that was did. a good, that was a good card. I'm oh, yeah. Saying. Yeah. Some of the guys were giving him props for that. I mean, and I thought it was interesting. They all roasted him at the comedy festival. And that was that was interesting. Um, oh, but, yeah. The comedy thing was very good. I, yes, I like yes. that. That was new and different. They picked on him. But do you remember who got the rose from the best impression on the group date? Do you remember? Grant. Grant, Grant's Grant, cute. I like right? him. Yeah, yeah, she likes him. That was a really, <laughs> a really, really nice interaction. Well, um, and they had a nice date, didn't they? They got had a nice little moment, a date afterwards, didn't they? Then they had they, a little. They got together afterwards. Yeah, yeah, yeah for sure. I don't know what they would call it a date because but... her one-on-one -on -one date yeah. came later. And yes, Marcus. I liked him from the moment. He got out of the limo. And I think he was the first one that got out of the limo. If I, if our memory is serving me. Um, yes. And took her skydiving. I mean, that was, a, I mean, that was a great date and she picked the date. right person to do it. Cause he's done it she before. Did. She did. Um, and she was really scared to the bejeebies out of her, but he calmed her and yeah. that was a great date. <clears throat> it really was. I mean, I, I don't know how handpicked that was. I started kind of going back and thinking, I'm like, okay, this is the military guy that already jumped out of airplanes. Of course he can skydive with her, right? So yeah. who knows? But I thought that she really, really um, got along well with him. So I thought that was great. 
to the second date, which was the photo shoot, which was oh quite interesting God. with all the animals. That, that was, was, that, that was, was great. That was funny. I thought that was really fun. Um, she keeps talking about Sam M and the chemistry that they have, right? Because that was the one she was making out with on episode one. You and I talked about that. But the best part was Akeem with the spiders. <laughs> I know. That was he was, I mean, <laughs> hey, I, I know in Australia, they're like house pets. And yes. so you just got to get used to them. But um <clears throat> Yeah, it's uh, it that was hilarious. But that was fun, and so they did. Um, did they have a, a dinner after that? Didn't one of them got? Did they have a special dinner? They one? did. Well, yeah. they were supposed to go to a cocktail party. Yeah, if you remember that, and she. Um, oh no, she did. She got a one-on-one -on -one date with Dylan. Yeah, Dylan that's is, like, yes, Dylan was the one who um, stepped up with the snake. Snake, right. And she liked that. That's right. They got together. And, and so remember that all the other boys had to go home and they, they were did. very excited. They, they, well, they were mad. Yeah, and they then, were then mad. that's when the whole uh, Devin Aaron thing even kicked up a notch even more because what's he do? He takes her away the, at the first thing in the cocktail party. And that starts He's, the whole He's going to be Maria. Yeah, I know. He's going to be Maria. And then Thomas N, right? Then he gets into it. And yeah. Devin's yelling at him that he's making a fool out of himself. And and then you've got Sam and them doing another makeout session. Then she's kissing Jonathan. And then, I mean, I was just like. Uh, I had to take notes. I was like. I oh. did. I, I have notes this time because I, I was like, what, what is going on? Any front runners yet? I mean, it was a wacky episode. It was hard to keep up with. I, I, I do need to take, keep taking notes here. I, mean, I know I do too. Well, so here's my thing is um, I was trying to figure out who the men were left because she, um, mm -hmm. she sent another, so she started. She sent Brian home. I thought Brian was going to be the drama king because he was the um, esthetician or the, you know, whatever consultant. Um, but he, it, he was, uh, he was sent home. There's right, 15 um, left. Uh, three left. Only three. Only three left. Okay. Because yeah, they, because, were, they yeah. started with 18. Yeah. Yes, they start, started right, with 18. Right. Um, I, and there are some that are getting a rose that aren't getting any airtime yet. So it's like, we don't know anything about them. Like um, Austin, we don't know much about Yes, Sean. I was surprised that he got one. Who? I was surprised that Austin got one. Because like you said, you haven't seen much. Haven't seen Thomas A, John. Uh, John um, so yeah, Sam's still in it, right? It's Both Sam's. Yeah. Our little innocent Sam, never been on a date. And then the other Sam... Although the so, oh, just lost my lost my earring, the <laughs> Sam that she had the makeout session with, I he's he's not it. You don't think so? I'm starting to make I'm starting to make predictions in two. Uh, uh -huh. He's going to go far, but I think he's too into himself. I do. Okay. I, I don't well, know. I could yeah, be. I could change. I, I I, none mind. of them, like you said, none none of them have been a real big standout now. Um, Grant though, like when she chose Grant and she chose Marcus, mm -hmm. that was like, okay, so maybe, yeah. you know, persuading yeah. one or the other. Devin is just a Devin. Like, He's not going anywhere. Know. He's not yeah. going anywhere. Yeah. Devin's going to get to the, he, Devin's going to go far. And Aaron, you know, you don't, did you notice they placed Aaron and Devin beside one another too at the elimination? Aaron, Aaron's a plant, ABC plant. You think so? Yeah, 100%. And the reason that I think he's a plant is because, remember, his brother was on oh. The Bachelor. Oh, that's right. And so they, yeah, I, I think ABC's got him groomed for the role that he's playing here. Uh -huh. that, I don't know. We'll see. I know. Well, I we'll do see. like Jonathan, too. Jonathan, um... Jonathan J. He's, he he's a nice guy. Yeah, he's he's got some little bit of swagger, but he's 
he's he seems fairly genuine. I like to look at the ones that are genuine. And I I think that um, there's a few of them. That's why Sam M. Yeah, he's good looking and they have the chemistry, but that's only going to take them so far. Yeah, I, don't, um, I, I know. So I I like Grant right now, but we'll we'll see. We'll I like see. Grant. I think Grant's a solid. I think Marcus is. I think Marcus. I like Mark. He's a stand up guy, and that's what she, she doesn't want any toxicity. She wants a real strong. Well, I, I'm 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 I like that, and so I don't know if you stayed and watched the previews afterwards. I didn't. Oh, so some sparks are going to fly this next one. Okay. Yeah. All right. Well, we'll be ready for that. So, yeah. so, so we got to be ready for that one. Drama filled on week two. Again, I'm, I was completely unexpected, but um, share in the comments uh, below if you guys have a front runner yet after two weeks. Yeah. We want you to join in the conversation. Shane already teed it up. Please subscribe. We want to be able to share this with as many people as possible. Have you join in on the conversation? And heck, if you want to join us for an episode because you've got something to say, we like to talk and the more the merrier for us. Right, Shane? Absolutely. We always like to talk. So, um, and yes. this one's this one's just starting to get juicy. So. It is. So more to come. Bachelorette Jen Tran, her journey to find love. Who this knows? You know, there's going to be some. Yeah, the second be... episode. That's all yeah. we're, we're, we're getting in. We're diving in. So this was a busy week for both you and I. So we made it. We got her done. So tomorrow night is another Bachelorette. So let's get ready. Absolutely. So in the meantime, you know, make all your moments magical. In the Bachelorette Nation and beyond. See you next, next time. time. Bye.